Giving it up, low lie, yo lie, boy, we living it up. Taking chances while we dancing in the party for show. Slip my girl a 44 when she crept in the back door. Hi, it's, uh, it's Liam, Liam Harold speaking. Just picked up your uh, email. It was just something I was gonna look into if, you spe if I spend a couple of Okay, Alright, cheers. Bye. Interesting. So, for those of you watching this wondering what's going on, currently in negotiations with the supplier in terms of the prices for garments that I'm making so the stuff that's going to be filling this shelf the stuff that's going to be the hoodies the t-shirts and the uh, joggers as well at the minute because of the order quantity it's quite expensive and so obviously in business you know you can't do anything if you're not making money ask advice from people that know what they're doing people that have been in business people that know a lot or have family members or what anything any advice that you can take from people take it and I mean I'm going on the grounds of if you don't ask then you don't get so we'll just see how it ha we'll see how it goes he's gonna ring me back in a few minutes time I'm not too sure how this is gonna pan out oh, brilliant oh, okay. it will more than likely be in the first couple of days of, the, of, of, of next week well that was easy <laughs> number one tip in business everyone you don't ask you don't get right okay so I just realized we're a couple of minutes into the video and I haven't done the prestigious old opening to the video so here goes nothing what's up guys and welcome back to LSJ TV I'm walking through the park right now back home you're probably gonna see me walking through here talking to you guys a hell of a lot this year so get used to the sight of these leafy trails leafy trails oh. so what I've just done is gone to the shop just the corner shop down the road to get some peppers I'm gonna be having fajitas for dinner because I've been looking forward to that for so 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 long so I've got some muscle food chicken out the freezer and later on we'll cook dinner first but then a little bit after that we'll get to the topic of today's video hello hello nope hold up That is the first thing I have eaten all day. Something about fresh this week has sort of almost taken my appetite away because I've been drinking so much, my stomach's just been a bit fucking Right, so it is time for the title of this video, time for me to explain exactly what I mean by the title of this video. And a few of you will already know if you know me at all or if you've seen my Instagram story or anything like that. But if you haven't, then let's get right into it. First off, I'll say I'm well aware that university is not for everyone. I mean, but even before I came, I, I didn't think I, I, I didn't think it was for me. But in terms of what I wanted to do, I wanted to be a teacher. I needed a degree, so I didn't think that university would. I didn't think I'd enjoy it. Like I, I was a bit of a goody goody. I did what I was, you know, supposed to do. I followed the norm and just stuck with it, went with it. But being here at university, the independence, everything that goes along with it has taught me to it's taught me to live a little, it's taught me to not break the rules but bend them ever so slightly. Just it just I'm trying to not make this sound bad guys, but it's taught me to live a little, enjoy myself and funnily enough, as this as this series is titled, grow. But back to the original point that I want to make. Making the most of every second. I'm well aware that this is my last freshers. Trust me, I don't know anyone who is more aware 
that this is the last time I'm going to have Freshers Week. This is the last time I'm going to be a part of this little, little ecosystem, little society almost. And I can't tell you how many people who have graduated or how many people who are older, 10, 20, 30 years older than me. Oh man, Liam, I wish I did this. You Make the most of it because you'll wish you did this, you'll wish you did that, you'll wish you did this. And I'll tell you fucking what, guys. No, I won't. Because I'm the guy, anyone who knows me, anyone who's watched this channel knows that I make the most of every fucking second. I try, and, I try and push it so much through the camera, but I can only say so much. I can only show you guys so much. Every, I guess, why I get so pissed off when I get told otherwise? If I get told that I'm not making the most of it, I'm not being appreciative, I get so fucking hurt inside. Because I know that deep down in my heart, regardless of what's on the exterior, I make the most, I appreciate everything I fucking have. When we live in a world full of such drama, full of such negativity on social media or whatever, I feel like it's my responsibility. People like me, who put themselves out there on social media, post content for people to see, people to enjoy, people to learn from. I feel like it's people like me. It's my responsibility to help people enjoy themselves, help people make the most of every second, just like I want to. That's why I try every single video to show you guys every single teeny little thing and go, oh, maybe I shouldn't have done that, but it's okay. I feel it's people like mine, not just mine, everyone that you watch, everyone you watch through a camera, on YouTube, on Facebook, Instagram, whatever. It is our responsibility to help you guys let loose a little bit, not, not go fucking crazy, not go ape shit. Just enjoy yourself. You can enjoy yourself without being a dickhead. You don't have to be a dickhead to appreciate the good side of things. Everyone always says to me, God, Liam, how are you so positive? God, Liam, how have you seen the positive in this? How have you seen the positive in that? Because if you focus on the negative, guys, it's just gonna be a negative fucking journey. The key is in the word, positive, negative. What's gonna fucking happen? You focus on the positive, you're gonna attract positive people. You focus on the negative, you're gonna attract negative fucking people. You don't want negative people in your life. You want people who are gonna help you. People will help you strive to be the best that you can be. People can help you to be the best that you can possibly be. And that is why I'm so appreciative of everything I fucking have. I'm well aware of the support network that I have, the unbelievable family that I have, the unbelievable friends that I have, the unbelievable girlfriend that I have behind me is unreal and I feel like it's my responsibility to show you guys that if you can find that support network, if you can find that help, find those friends and family, then you can just, it's why I'm enjoying Freshers the way I am because I know, I know, I know, I know and I know I've said it so many times already, said it so many times in the past but this is my last time doing Freshers and to be honest guys, that's pretty fucking shit. And so what am I gonna, I've adjusted my training, I've only been to the gym twice this week. I said I'd go three times, I've only been twice. Shit happens, that's okay. That is the price I've had to pay for these lifelong memories that I'm gonna make. I can't emphasize it enough guys, purely because something could, your life could change at any minute, any fucking second. Right now, something could change that would change your life forever. And you would have no control over it. That's just how life is. Unfortunately, that's just how the cookie fucking crumbles, guys. Life's shit, but you can make the best of it. You have to make the most of every single second because our time is fucking short. It's real, real fucking short. So to the first years, the second years, the third years, or like if you're a fourth year, if you're doing whatever, make the most of life and enjoy it for what it is because our time is real real short. I'm going to keep showing you guys my experiences, the ups, the downs, and we're going to share this, share this fucking roller coasters together that we call life. Uh, I'm getting hyped up, I'm getting emotional, I'm getting... We're going to do this together, guys. Together, we will grow.